All right, folks, Queen Rogue Kill Candy here, and today we're doing a box opening action replay. This one's suitable for Sega Saturn. Um, it says plus. It's an action replay three in one. So, um, adds memory expansion. I heard that if you get one of these, you can also play um, Japanese. Yeah, see, uh, allows Japanese and European games. So, I ordered some, like, games for a... Uh, a dollar on a uh, line and hang on I'm going to just open this I cut this but I need to get it open okay so I pulled it out of its box it's brand new uh, it's made in China looks pretty cool so you stick this on the expansion port in the back of the Saturn apparently it also takes the place of your watch battery so I don't know we bought some watch batteries for it but um, we haven't opened it yet, um, so I might take them back because we're not going to need them. So I'm just going to quickly take this over to the Sega Saturn. Um, it's kind of dark in that area, so we'll see. We'll see how well this works out. Okay, so here's the Sega Saturn. I'm just going to quickly pull it out. Um, I had this all nicely organized, but my husband... He couldn't figure out what was what, and then he changed my organization. So now the spaghetti monster lives here. Uh, <laughs> and, um, yeah, I need to fix that. Okay, so this goes into the back here. Now, I don't have any Japanese games right now. They're in the mail. But in theory, this is supposed to make the games look better. Um, it, the watch battery in the back... Um, you don't need to replace that anymore. Um, yeah. Oh, and quick note. I also suggest getting these redone controllers for the system. Because it's just nice to have new controllers for an old system. Anyways. Um, I gotta figure out what number this is on. On the retro setup. Um... So it's on, just have to turn this on, power is here. Alright, so it's right now on PlayStation, so let's see what number it's on. Might be going through these too fast. There's a switch box up here I gotta hit to go through them all. And yes, there's a game system on each of them. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to pause this and I'm going to try and find it. Alright. So, might see some lines or something because of the camera. But, I don't know if I notice any difference, honestly. Oh yeah, yeah, you can also use it for cheats. I remember reading that. But anyways, they say that this is, because I'm new to owning Sega Saturn, never owned one one when I was a kid. They say that this is like one of the first things you have to buy for your system. And, uh, yeah. So it's loading. <laughs> well, it is an old game. Um, I don't know if it's actually going to make any graphical... Improvements. Uh, okay, it's just not loading. Well, great start. Uh, <laughs> okay, hang on. I'm just going to pause this because I don't know how long it's going to take. Ten minutes later. I don't want cheats. Why are you taking so long to load? Hey, we're still loading. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Alright, totally my fault. Uh, my husband, he took out the game that was in there. So, I'm going to put that in. And then we'll see how that runs. And no, don't play any... Game arts. <laughs> don't play any music, please. <laughs> okay. 
So if you are familiar with this game, I don't know. Actually, it does look a lot better. I wish I had something more graphically daunting for the system. I used to have, uh, well, we picked up D, but it ended up having a crack, so we had to take it back. And so I don't really have that many things for this system yet, because we just bought it. Games are like, three arms, three legs, and you probably have to go borrow your neighbor's legs, too. Well, actually, this looks a lot better. Wow. That's noticeable. Hmm. <clears throat> Alright, well. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like and subscribe for if you want more uh, retro things going on. Um, thank you so much. Love you so much. Bye. Hit that bell up there if you want to see more.